What's going on, Shady people? Shady Penguin, welcome you back to another episode of our Pokemon Black Randomized Nuzlocke Challenge. If you guys are excited, please be sure to show some shady love to that thumbs up down below. It needs to touch, and remember, if we crush 2,500 likes, I will keep two videos a day coming your way. That is what I say. Now, today we are here, and I have a very important question for you guys. Now, the title of this video is, Tell Me I Suck. And the reason why that is, is because I'm concerned with our channel. Now, our channel is doing fantastic. Uh, I am... I could not be prouder, but I want to make sure that I'm bringing content that you guys want to see. And there's definitely been a decline in support throughout uh, the thumb, throughout views, throughout comments, everything. So question of the day for this video. And the reason why I chose this video to do it in for now, I didn't make a separate video is because this is probably the second least most watched uh, series on the channel. And I love this series. So I want to know. I want to know from you guys that are watching, because I consider you guys, I guess, I guess like the, the hardcore shady people because you're the watching the least watched series. I don't know how to explain it, whatever, but I trust you guys and I want you guys to be completely honest with me. Tell me in the comment section below, be as you can honestly and you can be as brutal as you want. Uh, try not to be too brutal. Tell me what you like about this channel and what you don't like about this channel. I want to know, is it is it this channel specifically? Are you tired of YouTube? Uh, if you are, you're probably not even watching this anyway, but I really want to take this question of the day and use it as a way to find out what you guys want. Is there a series you miss, aka Road to Ranked? Is that a big reason why you've stopped watching other series on the channel? Let me know, let me know. Just everything you like, everything you dislike. I really do need your help because I don't want to see this channel slip into uh, anything less than what we've made it to be because you guys have come through all the time and that's why I'm bringing the catchphrase back. Maybe that's one of the things, who knows? Maybe that's one of the things that was a detriment to the channel. I don't know, but now that I can Completely promise you two videos a day. I want to bring that back and we will be bringing that back So we're gonna continue on in Pokemon black. Please feel free Like I said be as honest as you want to be last time we left off on the cliffhanger uh, I actually had to replay this entire part Because I lost my save and I was saved before the ice gym basically before the last episode and um I don't remember who we taught strength. I think it was spandex but uh, I'm going to go back to the other video and check after this because I didn't teach anyone strength because I didn't use it the second time around to get through. But we're going to see what's going on right now in this story. Oh, there's... Oh. Ah! I didn't expect the Pokemon to be there right now. Oh. Yo. Yo. Imagine this with 6 gen graphics. I don't remember this at all. Oh my goodness. What do you think, Shady? How do you like the powerful form of the Pokemon who appears before and fights beside the hero that will lead the way to a new world? Now, Zekrom and I will head to the Pokemon League and defeat the champion. This will be the last of the Pokemon battles that her Pokemon sow. A world for Pokemon alone. It's finally going to be a reality. Yo, look at him just, he just started hovering. He doesn't even care. He just left. If you want to stop me, you must become a hero as well. That's right. When Zekrom's counterpart, Reshiram, recognizes you, we will finally be even, and then you can try to stop us. Well, what will you do? My prediction. If the future that I see is true, you will meet Reshiram. The Pokemon with you believe in you strongly. Will you be the one who interferes with my formula for changing the world? If you want to protect the bonds between Pokemon and people, you must search for Reshiram. I'm sure it is waiting for you in the form of the Lightstone. Oh, is it? Oh my gosh, you just scooped him up! Shady, did you see what flew off just now? How could this happen? Why? That was the guy N, right? Why was he with the legendary Pokemon? He couldn't really be the hero, could he? Also, did I hear him tell you to search for the other legendary Pokemon? Calm down. First, we go back. It's more important to decide what to do next than to analyze what just happened. So we're going back. We're just going to go back. I thought there was going to be more to happen in there, to be honest. I didn't think it would just be a little cutscene, or else I might have done it last time. Astounding! I never would have imagined a legendary dragon type Pokemon would return now. The guy called N. Team Plasma's boss apparently reawakened the legendary Pokemon. He told Shady to look for the other legendary Pokemon, then flew away. Huh? There are two legendary dragon type Pokemon? Yes, yes there are! It's gotta be all there, come on. Yeah, I love this guy. Ho ho! Why, if it is an alder, it's been a while. Have you been well? Ha, oh, no time for chit chat. These violent flashes of lightning that shot from the tower. The Pokemon has the power to destroy the world. If it's on Team Plasma's side, and Team Plasma tells everyone to release their Pokemon, no, no matter whether it comes from fear or admiration, the world can't help but change. It will become a world where we are separated from Pokemon. 
Right. Moreover, the boss of Team Plasma N, who reawakened Zekrom, apparently said to look for the other Pokemon, Reshiram. If I remember the myth, Zekrom's power electricity, along with the other Pokemon, devastated ancient Unova in an instant. Even knowing that, and he's still wanting to awaken the other? Huh? I isn't it dangerous to bring back a Pokemon that powerful? Miss, you are a very kind person. Still, I don't know if other Pokemon will be able to stand up to it, because no matter what, it is a legendary being. I don't like the idea of taking orders from End, but searching for the dragon, the stone, might not be a bad plan. We certainly can't let Team Plasma reawaken both of them. Since I've traveled all over Unova, I have an idea of where it might be. Shady, let's head to the Relic Castle. Everyone, I'm going! I see. I'll leave that to you. I'm going to investigate inside the tower. Hopefully I'll find something. Then I'll go with you. Alright, so... We have to... Where, where did he tell us to go? I think I understand better now. Being able to do something for Pokemon, for somebody at a time like this, is strength. I'm sure of it. And my strength is something that's given to me by Pokemon. Okay, champion, let's hurry! Alright, he said we're going... Where? Not, it, was it Relic? Relic Castle? Shady, this has turned into a big deal. So confusing. I don't know what to do. Are you going to go to the Relic Castle, Shady? Pass Route 4 in the Desert Resort. I hear that's where the Relic Castle is. Oh, is it? Do we have Fly yet? Like, do we do we get Fly in this game? I don't remember ever getting Fly. I bet you one of my Pokemon knows Fly. It does. Misa Misa knows Fly. I'm a fool of a took. Maybe that's why you hate the channel. I don't know. <laughs> oh, my goodness. All right, so let's fly... Uh, Let's see, Relic Castle, Relic Castle, Relic Castle. Where's Route 4? This is, this is Driftful. Uh, route 16, Route 4. Uh -huh. All right, so let's fly to Nimbasa City and backtrack our way to, gosh diggity darn, Route 4. And we already got our encounter in Relic Castle, so I don't think we got to be doing none of that. Uh, we just got to go ahead and see what the Legendary Pokemon's going to be randomized into. Wait, I wonder how that works. Don't I need to have him with me or something? I, I, I really don't know. I couldn't tell you. I couldn't tell you how that works. Uh, I think it's right over here to the left is where we go to go to the Relic Castle. I believe it's where we go. Yeah, it's definitely where we go. Look at these trucks. Look at this, this, <sighs> these aesthetics that they added in. I'm probably gonna throw a rappel up sooner rather than later. Okay, well, obviously later rather than sooner. Ooh, a core fish. I love me a core fish. We're gonna get the heck out of here. No, I took one step! All right, we're not wasting any more time. We're not wasting any more time. Show me that repel. Show me that repel. That's the wrong, that's the wrong bag. That's clearly, clearly the wrong bag for the repel. Uh, let's continue onwards into Relic Castle. Oh, by the way, guys, I know I asked you about uh, what you like in the main channel, but I also wanted to mention that the second channel, if you're not there, there's some crazy stuff going on. There's a spider in here. Oh no, come on. No, it's the bee all over again. I'm just gonna keep an eye on him. Bees, spiders aren't as bad to me as bees. Bees can like fly. This thing is just gonna keep crawling. I'm gonna keep looking up. But um, there we got some really cool stuff going on. And he's just finishing up very, very soon. Uh, there's this, this next game that I'm gonna play. It looks incredible. Incredible. If you like platformers, I'm also playing Adventure Pip right now as a platformer. Oh, we can go down here. Or maybe now we can actually. Why are you freezing? Oh, that's why. Shady, stop! That's the entrance to the Relic Castle. You're impressive, Shady, making it here before I did. Dealing with the Desert Resort's Pokemon took longer than I would have thought. I only made it all the way out here thanks to my Pokemon. Elder went. Alder went on ahead. Let's hurry. So Alder, Alder, Alder. But. Next game looks really, 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 really cool. Uh, it should start that probably the end of this week, to be honest. And then, of course, we're going to be doing Batman over there when it comes out. Oh, I got to battle this chick, girl. What's she doing? Just being here fills me with magical power. We're going to be doing um, Arkham Knight. Comes out June 23rd, I think, but that's going to be on the second channel. Uh, and then Shady Lady actually might be making a guest appearance on that channel Uh I don't know if it's going to be after Amnesia. I'm not sure. There's just, she wants me to play this horror game. It's a scary game. But it's like, I think, it's called Monstrum. I think it's called Monstrum. Um, she found, I asked her, I told her I wanted to play some scary games. So she was looking on Steam yesterday, uh, two days ago. And she found it and she sent it to me. And I was like, oh, so it's really cool. So we're going to do it. I'm going to do it. And then if the series gets enough support, she's going to jump in and play at least one episode, uh, which will be really, really funny. So please, please support that. Oh my gosh, that'd be so hilarious. Um... 
but we should be we should be things are going good over there things are going great but i just all around i want to bring content that you guys want to see also content i enjoy why is this running so slow today what the heck is going on i really have no idea why it's oh we get the flinch on the needle arm mo i love you mo i love you i love you mo no i love you mo no i love you mo Mo is in more. Yogi Gross level 36. Also, my levels might be a little bit off because of redoing my save. And I blasted through with Inferno. But I do apologize for that. Uh, I think we're able to actually go past him now. Yes, we are. We gotta find. Oh. Gets just told us that once again we should test how much power you have. We will see if you can defeat Team Plasma. Is that really. A like, so, Plasma Grunts are just stationed all over Unova just to test me. Just to, And why are they listening to Getsis when N is, like, the king? N is the king, so why? Who cares about Getsis? Getsis is is not okay. It's not... It's, what? It's, I don't understand. I would only listen to N. If I was part of Team Plasma, I would be listening to N every day of the week. That's about it. You're intimidating me? Ah, uh, now Flame Wheel might not act. Oh, Rock Slide! Oh, Rock Slide. Oh, Rock Slide. I deserve that. I do. I do deserve it. I will take it. I will take my punishment and I will go for the rock. Now there's no reason to go for rock slide shady. It's less accurate and it's not, it's gonna do. <sighs> well, we connect, thankfully. Thankfully we connect and my screen does go down. Could have done that a turn ago. Fire PK, Meganium. Oh, and of course I would love to have Meganium work for us, but we're gonna go out into spandex here. Resist stab times four and get a nice Bug bite. Do I have bug bite yet? What do I have on you, Spanix? I got something on you. There's something there. Something is there. Bug bite. You are there. I'm gonna go for the bug bite. Just in case you got a berry, you're gonna eat it up. I uh, don't wanna go for poison tail first. That is a two hit KO. Pedal dance me all you want. It's just gonna end in your confusion. Poison point from a pedal dance. Oh my perfect. Pip -lup. I couldn't think of a P word. I almost said pansy. I didn't know what else to say. We're gonna just get this thing out of Get out of here, Meganium. You're the least. Popular second gen starter, although I always chose Chikorita as a kid. I know, I was a foolish child. Uh, I never chose Soda Dollar Cyndaquil. I don't know why. I just gravitated towards the. I just always gravitated towards the uh, grass type starter as a kid. Even I think even third gen, I, I chose Trico. I did. I did. It was not until, uh, well, actually, I hardly played fourth gen. Maybe that's why I didn't play it through, because I think I chose. Um, who did? I have actually have no idea who I chose for fourth gen. I'm not sure at all. I'm not sure at all. Don't harden, cause Cascoon, Cascoon, Cascoon was. Oh my gosh! I really just missed a cut. Yogi, you're supposed to protect the forest, and that means cutting down hardening bugs. And you're just gonna miss. You're just gonna miss. Yo, yo. All right. So my my brother showed me this app, and it's really useful for me. And if you're into, I know we're like over halfway through this episode, usually most people stop watching my now, but listen, if you're into, like if you're, if you want to get into shape, there's this app, let me see what it's called. He showed this to me yesterday when my family was up from Florida. Um, it's called Vimo Fit. Vimo Fit. Now you can literally choose that you're a beginner. You could say that you want to do cardio and it will generate a 10 minute workout for you. And literally have someone on your iPhone or your, or your Android device showing you what, how you do the move and stuff. It's the coolest thing in the world. And it's so, like, it's so encouraging. It's a 10 minute workout. I'm going to do it like in between rendering. Um, and that's it. And even if that's the only thing you start with, that's how I feel like I want to start. I want to start getting back into like, I was going to the gym and stuff before I moved and now I'm not. And I really have to get back involved in that. And unfortunately I'm paralyzed. So this Buffalo's going to head charge me. Oh my gosh. That was so foolish. That was so foolish. Is head charge normal or is head charge? I don't know if head charge is normal or rock. I really don't know who has the best, who has the best defenses on our team. 91. That was such a foolish move. All right, we're gonna go into the Brittany. Because Brittany does have the highest defense. Fire PK almost went down. But yeah, I wanna get back in the street. I really wanna, I really, 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 there's multiple reasons why. Uh, I can't wait till you, till, I just can't wait. There, there's something that's gonna happen very soon and I can't wait. Um, my speed is gonna harshly drop, which is unfortunate. We got Sacred Sword on Brittany, so. Hey, Brittany, why are you messing with me? 
And you, come on, you guys know the song. For the sickest kids, play song on song so many times, you guys gotta know it. You guys really gotta know it by now. Uh, we're just gonna finish him off with a bug bite. Because no reason to waste him the sacred sword. You can't horn, don't attack me with your horns. You're gross, you nasty. Uh, Bufalon is going to faint at Britney's, I wouldn't call them hands. What are they, claws? I don't know, pinchers. Uh, Baltoy. Baltoy, we go out of the Kenshin right now. I have to heal up Fire PK now because that was a foolish move on my part. Completely foolish move. Yet again, Team Plasma, oh, I can't believe they're just stationed everywhere. It's just, it's foolishness and nonsense is what it is. Kenshin, we have two stars. This is crazy. This is crazy. I can hardly remember what Kenshin start out, starts out as. Samurai. Ashwat, Ashwat. Okay, gotcha. Okay, let's go ahead and let's heal up. Do we have a paralyzed heal? We have a hyper potion. Tell me we're not gonna be able to heal PK from his paralyzed. We're gonna have to switch him. We're gonna switch him if we don't have anything. Oh my gosh, where are my berries at? Do I have anything to heal paralysis? There we go. A cherry berry. Nice and cherry berry for fire PK. PK loves cherries. He's a cherry fiend. Okay, so I'm guessing we should go this way because there's a Team Plasma Grunt here. So because there's a Team Plasma Grunt here, I'm guessing this is the way to go. Oh, a Close Combat's gonna obliterate you. I'm sorry, Zigzagoon. I'm sorry. Wasn't that serious. All right, so I'm guessing... Bone Rush! Hold on, is that supposed to be Earthquake normally? I think that's normally... Wow, it's still a ground type move. That's actually really good. It was randomized to a ground type move. Wait, no, is Bone Rush ground? Uh, I think I gargled. I don't think it's ground. It is ground. Yes! Wait, oh, but... Oh, it's so weak. I don't have any ground type Pokemon to teach this to anyway. Uh, Brittany can learn it. Kenshin can learn it. Spanix can learn it. I'm not gonna teach the end of them because Bone Rush is kind of subpar. You have to hit four times for it to be equal to Earthquake. And I accidentally ran through this one. So let's hope it's the right one. Ah. <sighs> I don't remember this. I don't remember this at all. Oh, wait, this is where we, isn't this where we, this isn't where we first came because there's an item here. We wouldn't have left an item here if this was where we first were. Bonsly, oh, you can catch a close combat. Don't sturdy me, don't endeavor. Why did that rock slide do so much from a Bonsly? What the heck? Bonsly's on roids, Bonsly's on roids, Bonsly's on roids. Oh, repel war off, I'm going to repel up. I am going to repel up. Oh, I just saw it. I just saw it. There we go. And hold on. I want to heal. Let me heal me when I get the feeling. Whoa, it's not. Uh, a wide lens, which is kind of good if we had a superior with Leaf Storm. Contrary. Is that a really run again? I'm a foolish fool of a tuck. Ooh, we're getting rewarded with an item. I found a dive ball. Worthless. Garbage. All right. So we could fall over here and over here. Um, so this is definitely the wrong place to be. Am I supposed to just keep going up? I feel like I'm not. I'm supposed to work my way down. I feel like I just made a terrible mistake. I did just make a terrible mistake. Awesome. Awesome. Oh, and I really ran. Are you kidding me? I mean, it doesn't matter. I don't think it matters. Ooh, an item. A oh, life orb! Yo! Who's getting that life orb? I don't really know. All I know is that I just remembered you guys told me a couple episodes ago. Shady, you got black sluds. Give it to Brittany. He doesn't need the lucky egg anymore. Who's getting this life orb right now? I feel like Fire PK is a perfect life orb user. Let's go, Fire PK. Let's go. I'm glad I fell down that hole now. Now I'm glad. No wonder why I've been like, I was wondering why I wasn't running as much. And now I remember, because like, you run and you get punished. All right, so let's go over here. We're gonna go down this one. Then let's, Pell's effect wears off. Of course it does. Yeah, of course it does. It's a regular repel. That is a super repel. That, my friends, right there. I guess we're gonna fall down this one. Let's give it a chance. Shoot, that was a mistake. All right, oh, do we really have to go? No, we don't have to go all the way back. We should be able to do so. Oh my gosh, we do have to go all the way back. Son of a gun, Relic Castle, more like Confusion Wujin. Is this the beginning? I hope so, let's fall. All right, this time we're gonna go the path less traveled and we're gonna have to face this grunt. So you know, you already know that this is the right way. Life Orb Flame Wheel, you can catch this. Groudon, no! 
It's been too long. It's been too long, Bacon. <laughs> no. I wish, yo, imagine. Imagine. We could have had a Kenshin and a Bacon on our team. This guy. This guy. Oh my gosh, and I forgot he sets up the sun. Scary face. He does not want me running. He does not want me moving fast. My nimbleness just became nothing. Nothing! That's pathetic! We got the defense drop, though, thankfully. And you're gonna rest already. Alright? I wasn't gonna hit the speed up button for this one, but, uh... He's gonna be this guy, so I'm gonna be this guy. Aqua Jet to finish him off. I don't care about your son! Encore, I wanna learn Encore? Nah, you're more offensive than anything. Nah, you're more offensive than anything. Hit him on top! I'm going to Misa Misa. I don't even care. Misa Misa's gonna fly all over this Beyblade. Show it to me, give it to me. Show me the money. Show me the money. There we go, add a girl, add a girl, add a girl, add a girl, add a girl. Let's grab this item. It's gonna be a person berry. Person berry. Oh, a double battle. Shoot, Misa, oh, it's not a double battle, it's just the singles. It's just two back to back. The Raptor! Too bad I got that rock slide. Wait, is it worth the risk? It's not worth the risk, Shady. Ah, but is it really not worth the risk? I think we're gonna do it. It'll KO if it connects. I have life orb. Yes! Oh my gosh, that was the longest wait in the world. You're going down, Strap. Don't tell me you're living. No! Oh. <laughs> I got so lucky. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. You can't whirl when we went up in the sky, can you? You should be able to, actually. But you miss. You just miss. So I'm gonna dive bomb this. That move should really be called dive bomb. You know, it looks more like dive bomb to me. Steal it, so I need a special. That's gonna be Kenshin. Kenshin come through. Oh wait, Kenshin, you hit physically. Ah, I misplayed. Do I even have Automize instead of rock polish? I see you big dog on your sandstorm automized grind. Oh my lanta. That is straight power. That is straight power. I like it, I like that a lot. Oh, okay, this time I have no no doubts that close combat will take him out. Because it's stab and it's close combat. Natsu, psychic, flying. I really don't have much for you. Going to the Yogi, just because I'm not weak to either of your stabs. I'm not weak to either of your stabs. I'm gonna let this episode run a little bit longer. Uh, just because of the intro, I was talking for like two minutes about why I suck and wanting to know why I suck. So we can go for faint attack, which should be super effective, and do a probably two a KO. Or a 1 KO! I didn't expect that. I always think Faint Attack is much weaker than I guess it is. Christian, explain to me the damage. Here we're going down again. <gasps> oh, and there you are, Sharon. Don't worry, I cleared all the grunts for you. You two, come here. Come to my side. It looks like everyone is here. It seems like you are working hard to resurrect Reshiram, the other dragon-type Pokemon, aren't you? But it appears the lightstone you seek is not here. Well then, congratulations are in order. Shady, you were chosen by our king. If you truly desire to keep the world as it is, where Pokemon live alongside people, you must bring the other dragon-type Pokemon spoken of in legend and battle with our king. Otherwise, Team Plasma will steal every Pokemon from every person in the world and release them all. Release them, you say? Do the Pokemon who live with their trainers actually want that? Is the liberation you talk about really just stealing Pokemon from people? Watch this. Champion Alder, even though illness took the Pokemon that had been your partner for many years, you haven't had a serious battle in all that time. Even you, who ordered the Elite Four to protect the Pokemon League and left to wander the Innova region alone. Even a champion like you now wants to protect a world where Pokemon and people live together. Darkness! Team Plasma's King will show the people of Unova that he 
is stronger than a champion who keeps Pokemon bound. And just like the hero who founded you, Nova, he will be accompanied by the legendary Pokemon. He will give this order. Trainers, release your Pokemon. For this, we have prepared a suitable castle for the legendary Zekrom and our king. I won't lose. I'll fight for all trainers who love their Pokemon and for all Pokemon who believe in their trainers. Our king has no interest in you. He has already determined that victory against you is assured. So you stayed behind just to tell me that? Just to make a fool of me? Of course not. I'm doing this out of kindness. Yes, kindness. I'm making sure the champion doesn't get hurt for no reason. Granted, the moment when someone loses all hope, I really do love to watch that moment. Fair. Well then, farewell. Wow, gets this. And Alder lost the Pokemon to sickness. Alder, what are you going to do now? Hmm. It seems my only choice is to return to the Pokemon League and battle end, but it bothers me to do exactly what Getsis wants. More importantly, what should we do about the Lightstone? Alder, why don't we go outside for now? Yes, that's a good idea. It's hard to breathe in here. So we're just, that's it. I worked my way all the way down there. I don't even get to explore. It's hard to put into words, but I'll never forgive them for this. What could that, what could that guy called N possibly want? Could he be trying to prove he is right by winning the battle of the two dragons? The X transceiver is ringing. Shady! Shady! Hello, Shady! Oh, you picked up! Hey, Shady! Come to the museum in Nat Green City immediately, right away! Got it? I mean, right now! So we have to go to Nat Green City. I could hear Professor Juniper voice for Oral Cloud clear over here! Seems like something big is happening. I wonder what is waiting at the museum in Nat Green City. I'll go on ahead. Uh oh. Oh, straight. Oh! Oh, swag! Oh, swag! I'll look around here once more. I don't want to believe what gets us, what the Getsis says. You should head for Nat Green City Museum. So we're going to end this episode right here. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please be sure to show some shade. I'd love to have thumbs up down below. We need your touch, and I'm going to get the heck out of here. And when we come back, we're going to head to Nat Green Museum and figure out what's why Professor Juniper's got her underwear in a bunch. Have yourselves a good day. But above all else, keep it shady.